Hello, everybody. Today, we're going to check out Last Epoch, a new ARPG game, which is the same kind of genre as Diablo and Path of Exile, a genre that I'm a very big fan of. So uh, let's give it a go, play the first 10, 15 minutes or so, and see what we got here. Uh, let's start out by selecting a class. So we got here Sentinel, then he turns into a Void Knight, a Forge Guard, and then a Paladin. Okay. Got Warpath, Field Bash, Javelin, Rebuke, Multi Strike, Lunge. Okay. This is like a rogue, yeah. Rogue, Blade Dancer, Marksman, then Falconer. And you get new skills every one you go up. Okay, okay. I'm digging it, I'm digging it. This looks like a wizard. Mage. Then to Sorcerer, Spellblade, and Rune Master. Alright, alright. Druid? Bro, oh, Primalist, Beastmaster, Shaman, Druid. Alright. And then what do we got here? Summoner or something? An Acolyte, Necromancer, Lich, Warlock. Okay. So we don't have a warrior, which is kind of interesting. I mean, I guess the paladin's kind of like a warrior. Uh, let's just mess around on um, a rogue. <laughs> Character name. I usually go with Sturd, but uh, it's a girl, so Sturdina? Uh, sure, that works. Continue. So you don't change what they look like or anything. Normal, you got hardcore. Hardcore is if you die, your character's gone. Solo account found, solo character found. We'll just leave it like that. Great character. And let's dive in. In the beginning, there was darkness. Only the terror, myself, and the void. Now, uh, let's not watch this. I was gonna. You guys can watch that on your own if you want. I don't want to waste time on that. I do have the game right now on max settings. And I'm rocking like 60 FPS, it looks like. And I don't have the greatest computer. I got a 2070 Super. A 2070 Super and... Uh, an R7-3800, I think. Not down a little bit. But yeah, I have it on um, very high graphics. So let's maybe go down to high, see what it changes. It pretty much still looks really good. Like, the graphics are I'm down with. What's this button do? Flurry? So it's just like super fast attacks. All right, all right, all right. Right click does like your auto attack, which is pretty normal for these type of games. Health potions, use health potions to restore your health. Okay. I just got a cloth hood. I'm guessing eyes inventory. Yes, it is automatically equipped. We got crafting materials. We got our slots. Blessings. I guess you discover blessings that you can add to your character, which is cool. Appearance. Oh, so you must can like transmog what you look like. I'm not gonna read this. I'm gonna like read this stuff when I actually play, but just for the video here, I'm not gonna bother. I do like the graphics though. That, this thing is mucking me. Short bow. Oops, I just spam potions accidentally instead of Q. Uh, yeah. Ah, this thing's so tough. Uh, 
Okay, you just gotta dodge. Okay. So you want to try and dodge what they do, what they do. Which makes sense, I guess, right? Like the fire. Stay out of the fire. We leveled up. We unlocked shurikens. Shurikens. Damage. Oh, okay, so it's like a ranged. Chuck your shurikens. Okay, okay. I do like the graphics so far, though. It runs very smooth. I'm at 95 FPS right now with my with my computer, which again, 2070 Super and an R7 processor, 32 gigs of RAM. Jeez Louise. You can swap skills on your action bar by left clicking on them and using the fly out menu to change any skills you have unlocked. Well, oh, that looks like it like stuns or something. This is throwing attack alt is more information. Uh, added damage applies from dexterity scaling. Okay, so it's telling you that based on this skill, the damage will increase by adding dexterity. Can I make something to my right? Like my left click. Mm, I feel like you should be able to. Maybe not though. Maybe you can only do it for right and then the rest is hotkeys. We'll just leave it for now. I'll look into that more later. The burning forest. We have made it to the burning forest. Oh, we got our first blue. Let's peep it. Hurricane traveling staff or eight lightning spell damage. That's cool, but we're not using it. We need swords and stuff. What's this? Shuriken, shuriken, shuriken. It auto loots the gold, which I'm a fan of. Definitely a fan of that. Oh boy. Oh boy, things are getting crazy. Shift, what does shift do? Okay. So shift is kind of like my little zoomy zoom zoomer. Was there a it was mine they were caught. I can handle all thanks. Are you also here? good? Name's Grail. I wonder. Come. Let me watch you fight. Okay, so he's following me around for now. Got a little sidekick, a little homie. Yes, there is some smoke. I like the shuriken toss. Gives me a chance to kind of get them low before they get in my grill, you know? Everything runs very nicely and smooth. I like it. I haven't found any treasure chests or anything like that yet, so I don't know if those are not a thing. I'm sure they are. Just probably haven't found any yet. It 
When I'm leveling up, oh, here we go. We got the skills. Oh boy, the passive system information. Gaining passive no points, mastery classes. I'm not gonna go into this in depth right now, just cause I'm just kind of showing some gameplay. It looks like we've only unlocked this tree, so we're clearly going into dodge and poison resistance. Oh, I see, and then as you get points in, it unlocks the next tier. And then also different spells. That's kinda cool, that's kinda cool. I can dig it. And then once you master rogue, you'll go on to like other ones. This is pretty cool, man. Pretty cool indeed. So much destruction. But for what? Wait, what was this right here? Oh, so they have shrines in them, just like the, all the other ARPGs. So now I have a higher chance of critical strike. Oh, we got ourselves hood and armor. X, yeah. We'll clip that right away. And we'll clip our hood too. Plus 35 dodge rating. Heck yeah. Oh look, we already got the gold sellers on the chat there. Typical man, every single game just full of bots and gold sellers and stuff. So obnoxious. Level 4. Uh, skill specialization. Also acid flask. Throw a flask of acid that explodes. Alright, let's try that out. Okay, so it... I think it poisons them, doesn't it? Or does it just do one explosion? Let's find out. We'll try it again here. Oh no, it does. It does dot damage it. Whoa, Nelly! Whoa! See when he does that, you get back, get back, get back, get back, get back. Uh. Poison flask him. Chop him up while he's frozen. Get out of there. Well done. We got Almost some more there. blue stuff. It looks like we've made it to the, the little spot that we need to go. They're traveling between them over and over. But yeah, there's the first little taste of uh, Last Epoch. I think it's pretty awesome so far. I'm excited to dive into it and play it some more. Check out the skill system a bit more, which is always fun to do. Learning all about new games and stuff is really fun. Looks like it's going to be a good time sink. Uh, hopefully it's better than Diablo and Path of Exile. Make sure to subscribe and like, and uh, when I make more videos, you'll be able to find out what I think moving forward. So thank you guys for watching. Have a good one.